photography now because uh, minutes uh, we can circle the whole earth and we do this almost 16 times a day so we can see a lot of things uh, forests mountains ocean you name it so uh, I, I'd like to share these photographies as well when I come back uh, uh, on earth so yes photography is my hobby now I didn't copy your last, uh, can you repeat the question? Over. Very interesting, very interesting question actually. I think it will work just fine here. It will flow definitely, but um, you need to steer uh, those cars with different thrusters. So it might go in, into one direction, but you need to brake. You need uh, another uh, uh, thruster from the opposite side. And this is the concept actually when we fly spacecraft. We have multiple thrusters that can uh, steer the vehicle into different directions. But I think if you have one thruster, it might just go in one direction. Over. Thank you, Jonathan. Uh, we do have a lot of facilities to stay in touch with our uh, beloved ones. So we have access to emails, we have uh, satellite phones, we have video calls as well. And ham radio, uh, this is just what uh, we're doing right now. So we have all the facilities to stay in touch uh, with the ground. Over. Very interesting question. So honestly, um, the, the good thing about uh, being in space, we can see stars without uh, atmospheric distortion. Uh, plus, we don't see um, any uh, blockage because we don't have clouds here. So we do see um, uh, bright stars, but in terms of distance, uh, it's not a big distance actually. We can see as much as we can see from, from Earth. Over. Very interesting question, and uh, I think two uh, main things, so physical impact, which is the loss of uh, bone density and the loss of uh, uh, body mass as well. So uh, we do have uh, countermeasures uh, uh, to do uh, uh, like uh, uh, better uh, return, which is uh, exercising for almost two hours and a half every day. So to maintain the body mass and the bone density.